Voicemail. Hey, John. This is Ryan. Um, I can't read your handwriting, man, and I don't. I don't know if this is the right place, man. I think, I, I think it is, but they don't have no street numbers on, on the place, so I'm not sure. But anyway, give me a call back and. Hold up, wait. Nah, I. <laughs> yeah, this is it. Yeah, I see it. Oh my God. Yeah, I'll, I'll call you. Yeah. Hi. Hey, how are you doing? I'm good. How are you doing? Good. You look, you look nice. Oh, thanks. Thanks. Um, well, do you want some lemonade? I made some. It's in the back. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I love lemonade. Okay. Man, right. it's like fresh lemonade. Um, yeah, I put lemons in it. Cool little place here. Thanks. Yeah. Um, well, here's the lemonade, and I have to run inside and get something real quick, but I'll be back in just a minute. Cool. Hey, how's it going? <clears throat> cool. Yeah, I'm, I'm good. Do you know how old that girl is? Uh, not exactly, but my buddy told me, you know, she's a bit younger than you. I was like, all right, no big deal. Have you ever done this kind of thing before? Um, yeah, I've been on dates before like this. It's no big deal. Date? Huh. Did you remember to bring condoms? <laughs> yeah, I mean, if something happens, I'm prepared. Well, I don't think that'll be happening. My name is Chris Hannon. And you're on to stop a deviant. Your sick ways stop here. No, 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 no. wait, wait, that, that's a mistake. Um, I, I'm not a pedophile, and I'm supposed to be on a blind date. Sure you were. Needless to say, that was the worst day I've ever been on. Look, I want to be on first date because I want a chance to redeem myself. All right, I don't want that to be America's only image of me. I want to show that I'm actually just a, a normal guy. Yeah. Sure. No problem. This episode should generate some great ratings for us. It'll benefit us both. Really? You're not. Oh yeah, that's so great, because I'm so worried that you won't want to do it because you're so taping it. Oh, come on, man. Why would I do that? This is going to be gold. That's so awesome. Like, I'm so looking forward to being on television this time. This is going to go so right. I know it. Isaac, thank you so much, man. You're not going to regret this. Yes. I'll be there. Susan, call Tom. Tell him I got a great episode lined up for this week. Yeah, I got that moron who went to the wrong address and ended up on To Stop a Deviant. <laughs> yeah, right, I know. What a sucker. Do you know how old that girl is? Bless me, it's all right. My name is Chris Hannon. And you're on To Stop a Deviant. Cut! Ryan, stop right there. I want you to check that sheet of paper with the address on it again, okay? But I know this is the place. I don't want to look like I get lost every time I'm picking someone up. People are going to think I'm a moron. Well, you know, America already thinks you're worse. Besides, we need this for the show. We want America to relate to you, okay? <sighs> okay. That, that's a mistake. Oh. Oh. Hi. <laughs> Ryan, right? <laughs> yeah. 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 You ready to go? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, didn't I recognize you from somewhere? You look so familiar. Oh. Cut! Look at sweetie. You're supposed to recognize who he is later, not now. All right? <laughs> so, um, yeah. Um. Cut! Good. Let's move on to the next location. You didn't tell me I'd be going on a date with the deviant guy. You don't want to do this? 
Okay, you're off the show. We'll do another episode next week. I am never gonna hear the end of it. And neither will you after my agent gets through with you. This is a dating show, not a date. You wanna be on TV or not? Help that career of yours? Or would you rather go back to what you were doing before? Those infomercials, who were they for? Oh yeah, Viagra. You forever wanna be known as the chick who gets boned in the Viagra commercial? Fine. That's what I thought. Why don't you be a good little girl and go back to your date? Whoa, wait. I don't drink. Cut! What do you mean you don't drink? In your profile, you said you like to go out at night. Yeah, but I'm always the DD. What, the designated deviant? Sicko. Wait, I was cleared, okay? That was just a mistake. Fine, then you're the designated dumbass. Whatever. Listen. You two have to make drinks for each other anyway. So Sarah, just make them a weak one, all right? And Ryan, this is reality TV, baby. So just act real, okay? Strong drink. Oh, um, come on, it wasn't that strong. Um, <clears throat> uh, yeah, Isaac, um, that wasn't too bad, right? I mean, besides the, the coughing part. Yeah, it was funny. America loves funny. Yeah, speaking of that, uh, you're gonna use other takes than that, right? You're not gonna use just that. I don't even think about that stuff right now. Cool, but you, you're gonna think about it, right? Um, so, what do you want us to say now? I don't care. This is the reality part of the show. What? No lines? This is your guy's five minutes of fame. Au naturel. So, um, um <laughs> what do pedophiles do for a living? What the hell is your problem? You know what, you're never gonna make me keep acting like such a bitch. Oh, so now you're giving me life lessons? Yeah. Well, thank you very much, Mr. Deviant. Yeah, you know, let's just get this over with. You can cut all that, right? Oh yeah, yeah don't worry about it. You, you got that right. You got it. Um, I had a good time tonight, thanks. Yeah, me too. Um, maybe we can do it again? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> That's a wrap. Good job, people. Man, dinner was brutal. You two are awful. Hey, Isaac, um, is it too late to back out of this? Like, I just get this feeling that all you did was make me look bad. And that's not what I signed on for. Are you kidding? We just shot the whole episode. It's done. Yeah, but, but, <laughs> I didn't get a chance to show the real me. All right, all this was, was me looking like a fool. Again. This date? It didn't show the truth about who I am. The truth? You want to know the truth? I'll tell you the truth. When the date goes too well, our ratings suck. Americans want to feel better about themselves by watching other people screw up. You were perfect, baby. You want to redeem yourself? Go on Jeopardy for all I care. What the hell is this, man? What, the final insult? Would you need to get a, a close-up of a guy whose life you ruined? Nope. I want to give you something. Think you might have some use for this. Be creative, eh?
have to. Cut! <laughs> <laughs> Our famous bell. Our famous bell.